quite a slight change of plan. We were due to go to Caceres, the lovely Roman town in southern Spain, but then the thermometer hit 32. That's just too hot. It's too hot for a dog. Um, so we're pushing on through and next stop will be Portugal where it's a couple of degrees cooler. So you can see we're at siesta time in this lovely little village that we've just stumbled across. And there's no one around really apart from the swallows and the stalks up on the clock tower. I don't know if you can make out their nest. We've got one hot but happy dog. Um, he's been in the back where it's quite cool and he's had a good drink. Pijamas. Me llamo Sara. ¿Cómo te llamas? Me llamo Sara. ¿Cuántos años tienes? ¿Cuántos años tienes? How old are you? ¿Cuántos años tienes? Literally, ¿cuántos, how many años, years tienes? Well, we've just crossed over into Portugal and that crossing was a bit underwhelming, to say the least. Um, it was just a little sign, blink and you miss it. And um, yeah, and apparently we're in Portugal now. Up the so other side of the river. Yeah. But that little town we just stopped at previously, there were orange trees all up and down the avenue and they were ready to pick. So I just reached out of the van and picked this one. Well, they had a whole square. So they had a whole square. Orange trees and they were laid everywhere. So, uh, yeah. Hola, Portu Portugal. And uh, yeah, let's see what Portugal has to offer. And where are we today, Bernie? Today we're at Castello Mendo. Castello Mendo. Yeah, this was a really important um, settlement and it's even, you know, it's, it's occupied since the Bronze Age and there's even traces of an old Roman village. And just um, at the front <clears throat> entrance to the village, there's two um, beheaded boars and this is to represent the links to the cattle rearing that took place in the village in the surrounding area. And it's quite a fascinating place that dates back, well some parts of it date back to the 12th century and then other bits were added on in the 16th century but it's been, it's kind of been lovingly restored in part um, and some people live here still. Yeah, it's really strange because some of the um, houses are like really run down and obviously nobody's lived there for lots of years and then you've got these other houses with cars parked outside that, you know, there's people living in. So this village, um, apparently in the 12th, 13th century, King Sancho II was really keen to encourage settlement and this was one of the first villages to have its own fair um, and also a weekly market. Just off this square as well, there's also a prison and a courthouse, so it was a proper, you know, kind of full community. And just a little climb out of the village brings you to these rocks at the top and the church, which we'll have a look at. Where are we now? We're at the Rock of Wishes um, and 
there's a popular tradition um, your wishes come true who can throw a stone or a pebble into the big rock which is just in front um, and there's usually a puddle there if it's been raining and their wishes come true if they can manage to get it in there You heard that some kind of sounds like some kind of horn going off, as in you know, I think it's the shepherd. a shepherd calling the flock. Yes. And this is where we call home for the night, a lovely little camp uh, stopover provided by the by the local mayor with um, with water facilities and uh, waste facilities. There's toilets just inside the, uh, inside the village as well. Um, yeah, a fantastic, peaceful night's sleep. And this is the view that we have to wake up to each morning. You really feel like um, you're in rural Portugal. Can't do this stop over because Every, every morning, every evening, the shepherdess is going past with the goats. We've just had a lady earlier asking us if we wanted to buy some cheese. Okay, so we're moving on now, uh, possibly into Portugal, I think, maybe back into Spain, who knows. But for now, well, we'll see you on the next one. Adios. Adios. And where are we today then, Bernie? And um, today we're at Castello de Castello Mende, Mendo. And where are we at today then, Bernie? Today we're at Castello de Castello Mende. No, it's just Castello Mendo. <laughs> <laughs> and there's a jeep. And where are we today, Bernie? Today we're at um, Castello Mendo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 